My love for swimming in the salty water does come at a price. My hair gets so dry and brittle from the salt water and I find it really hard to avoid split ends from forming. I've learned a lot about caring for long hair over the past few years, one thing being that long hair just can't be combed with a regular hairbrush. I've also been using all sorts of products on my hair to help keep it looking silky smooth and healthy while I've been growing it out, with this leave-in hair conditioner being a recent game changer for me in helping to combat the damage my hair endures after long swims in the ocean. If you're looking for an alternative to those toxic, chemical-filled leave-in hair conditioners, here is a recipe for a natural leave-in conditioner that's inexpensive, won't leave any residue, which was super important for me so that my hair didn't look greasy after use, and can be made in less than 5 minutes. This recipe works for all hair types, whether you have straight or curly hair, and helps to hydrate dry hair without those ingredients that often weigh hair down, such as coconut oil or shea butter. To make this leave-in conditioner, start by combining all of the ingredients, including half a tablespoon of vegetable glycerin, one tablespoon of aloe vera gel, one tablespoon of full fat coconut milk, four tablespoons of distilled water, one teaspoon of vitamin E oil, and 10 drops of rosemary essential oil into a four ounce glass spray bottle. Then cap the lid on tightly and give the bottle a gentle shake to combine the ingredients and to dissolve the aloe vera gel. Store this natural leave-in conditioner in the refrigerator for up to one week. Make sure to shake the bottle before each use as the ingredients can separate. To use this conditioner, use it as you would a normal leave-in hair conditioner. Simply shake the bottle before use, then spray your hair generously with the solution. Allow the conditioner to sit on your hair for a couple of minutes, then brush it through with a wet brush or comb to coat each hair strand. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video tutorial for making a natural leave-in hair conditioner at home. Please let me know if you try this recipe out yourself and what you think. I'd love to know. I wish you a wonderful day or night wherever you are in the world. I send you all my love and I'll see you soon again.